A Glide woman was in Washington, D.C. last week as a guest of U.S. Representative Val Hoyle for President Biden's State of the Union address. NBC 16's Rigo Aguilera visited her when she returned to Oregon to learn more about the once-in-a-lifetime experience. Danielle Hubbard is an Army National Guard member and second-year nursing student at Umpqua Community College. Getting to attend the President's State of the Union was educational for her long-term success. I felt always welcome when I was around her. And when I was actually in the State of the Union, she was always introducing me to different people. She would stop me and say, look, that's a senator. And I was like, a senator? <laughs> Whoa. Or she was like, let's meet this congressman. Uh, it was really cool. She met Representative Val Hoyle on UCC's campus and left an impression on the congresswoman. She gave us a tour of the nursing, uh, of the, the nursing program and her poise and her knowledge and her ability, ability to articulate what it meant for her to be in the military, to have access to an education, to overcome enormous challenges in her life. It just struck me and I thought this is the kind of person that we're talking about that that truly is able to live the American dream. Hubbard says she will take the Washington DC experience with her forever as she carves out her professional career. She believes the tight-knit community of Douglas County pushed her to become someone greater. I really want to show troubled youth, especially young women, that you have so much potential. Just believe in yourself and ask for help. Reach out. We are here as a community to help each other. Hubbard plans on graduating the Registered Nurse Program this June while also deploying in the fall this year. Reporting in Roseburg, I'm Marie Graguilera.